not strong enough. I'm not fast enough. I'm not assertive enough. I'm too nice. I'm too girly. I'm too emotional. I have an attitude. I was made for the Army because I'm empathetic. I'm made for the Army because I'm always prepared and I plan ahead. I was made for the Army because I care about people. I think there's a, a common misconception that when you join the Army, you kind of have to forfeit your femininity and, and give up on being a girly girl, um, and that is not the case at all. You can, you know, go out and get your nails done and then go to the range and qualify on your weapon. Um, you can do a full face of makeup and then go out the next day with a full face of camo face paint and, you know, do your training like any other soldier would. Um, I think there's a lot of opportunities for women to maintain their individuality and still serve their country um, to the fullest extent. As a woman with 15 years in service and a mother, it can be challenging at times. But when I take off this uniform and I go home, I go into mommy mode. So even though I may be at home in mommy mode, I can switch back into soldier mode at any given moment. One of the common misconceptions uh, that come with being a woman in the Army is that you have to be uh, look like a male all the time, or you have to be tough all the time. Um, I can still be me. I wear my lip gloss, I wear my hair down, I order regular clothes. Um, I don't look like this outside of this uniform. Uh, I take pride in it, however, at the same time, I take pride in being an individual and a woman and girly girl at the same time. So you can still have your own identity as well as wear this uniform. I am Army Strong. I am Army Strong. I am Army Strong.